Oh. Ah. Of course, I gotta get these laced up because, yeah, this, this is not it. I like these. Saying home runs, I don't do this for fun. They got Marin Judge with it, tough with it, burning through paper as if a slug hit it. See you pay, now it's time to pay attention. Ski! Welcome back to the channel, Sonny Squad. And if you're new, welcome to the channel. How y'all doing? I'm Sonny and this is Sonny Kicks. And today we're here to talk about no other than the great, the wonderful, very unexpected Air Jordan 2 Union, and this is the fall gray colorway. This is the box that the shoes come in. And if you can see that closely, there are details on the box that are also on the shoe. Sizing label reads Air Jordan 2 Retro SP, Gray Fog, Siren Red, size 11 and a half. And let me know if I'm wrong, but I think these retailed for $225. The inside of the box is also really nice. You got both logos of Union and Jumpman, and it has the Flight and Union under there. But instead of having Flight under the Jumpman, they put it under the Union and vice versa. And they did the same thing throughout the tissue paper. The shoes also came with a set of spare laces. You got yellow in that like fog gray, fog blue, whatever you want to call it. But in my opinion, I really like that cream colorway a lot better. And for anybody wondering, I did pick these up off of Go App. Pretty low in resale at the moment, and to this day they're still going down because if you didn't know that release day horrible that was just atrocious in my opinion i participated in it it was just gross and but going back to sizing i went down a half size to 11 and a half and they actually fit perfect so if you have slim to narrow feet like me i suggest going down a half size but if you do prefer that extra room then go true to size if you have regular feet i would suggest going true to size and for wider feet people i feel like you can honestly go true to size with these and you'll be good but if you want to be on a safe side go up half size but i don't really think you need to do that with these so like i said earlier this is my first ever jordan 2 and i ain't gonna lie this shoe is just it's it's fire i i gotta admit this is fire union really did put a nice touch on the jordan 2 to make somebody like me actually want the shoe Prior to this release, there's only two Jordan 2s that I actually like, and those two are the Varsity Reds and the Dornbeckers. I thought the Infrareds were all right, but other than that, I really wasn't looking for Jordan 2s at all. They just looked big and clunky, and I just, I, there's so many other models out there that I wasn't sweating them at all. I didn't care for them, but this one right here, it's like they put a more casual lifestyle vibe on the shoe. It's like if you compare this to a regular Jordan 2, it looks a lot thinner. Like the tongue has this kind of deconstructive vibe onto it. So it's not as padded as regular twos. Same thing with the collar of the shoe. It seems like it's a little bit more thin and it's not like that alone is what made the shoe better. Well, like wearability wise, that's what made it better. But there's a great mixture of neutral and vibrant colors that just makes the shoe work and I'm all for this. This fall gray throughout the shoe is just mad nice. I don't know what made them come up with that idea, but it's super valid, especially mixed in with this blue. That red is so, it's so clean, mixed with the cream. Then you got a hint of yellow with this Union LA tag. There's also some yellow stitching underneath the Union Jumpman tag. Nobody can see the insole, of course, but the insole is yellow with the red Jumpman Union. There's also some sort of tag on the collar of the shoe. And I'm not sure what it's supposed to resemble, but it looks dope in my opinion. These shoes are just... They're so clean. I didn't think I would be liking the Jordan 2 this much. And usually my final test for if I really want to keep a sneaker in the collection or not is when I put it with outfits. And I actually already wore this for a day. They are so comfortable. Let me say that for one. I really like the comfort level on these. And second thing, I wasn't having any trouble putting outfits together with this. It just felt easy. So yeah, these are definitely staying in the collection. I really like these a lot. We interrupt this program to bring you... Well, what a way from being higher than the admins. 
fear No man but God and that's barely Loyal to the fame and to the money whom I married I rap like Bruce Fight, it's hard to compare me I might be too nice for y'all to act scary I'm very sure I'm more than you can fathom I spit acid, all the shit that you can't imagine Pen and padding, paper darkening from the ashes Of raw classics, class act full of madness I heard the early bird gets the word and I don't know if anybody really noticed this on their pairs, but they do have the size on the outsole of the shoe. So I got a size 11 and a half. And as you can see, it says 11 and a half. And in terms of materials used throughout the shoe, they got a sweet suede throughout the toe cap mug art leading up to the mid panel, eye stays and back tab of the shoe. This feels so nice. Behind the tongue and the inner liner of the shoe is made of this really this really clean leather like it feels so good on your foot throughout the collar toe cap and tongue you have this really cool canvas material and then on the collar there's this circular stitching which is the detail that's implemented on a box and there's more of that stitching underneath the tag on the tongue the midsole is pretty standard nothing new there there is another pair of union twos that these had came out with and it goes by the name ratin I, i'm not sure if i'm saying that right and i really do think the colorway is really nice but i'm not trying to pay that resale price it's going for it. so for sure I definitely had to go with the fall gray. Regardless, it looks better and it's going for a lower price. So that was just a win-win in my opinion. And yeah, this shoe just looks so good. I'm glad to have it in the collection. It's definitely gonna stay. It's not going nowhere. <clears throat> It's me, I'm a local to dawn Giving you bars and you ain't getting bummed Locked in a cell in your mind I've been here for some time and it's crazy we don't get along I see the way you be plotting this shit It's all in your eyes when you pocket the grit One thing that I know you best running that store You take everything green and you pop them in dip To tell you the truth, you're an opportunist If you think you can then you gotta do it Pull up on the brakes and a rocket through it At the end of the day, this is riding music I'm the man, not your man, baby, don't confuse it And I don't give a damn about a humble movement I'm just talking my shit cause I'm going through it I don't bug, I don't hear, I'm a fucking loser and I'm really surprised with how many outfits this can actually go with. I thought it was going to be pretty limited to like an athleisure type look or something, but nah, you can really style these. Now, if you enjoy content like this, you might as well hit that subscribe button because that's all I do here. I got sneaker reviews on feeds, how to styles, how to lace. I got clothing videos. I got, got a lot of more different things planned along the way. So yeah, go ahead and hit that sub button. The grind is not stopping. We're in that road to 20K. Comment down below what you think of the Air Jordan 2 Fall Gray. And... Yeah. Hope you guys all have a great day. Stay safe. See you next time.